Hello everyone, I'm your trainer Shafiq Ahmed. Today we will talk about phrase one off, which is very common, but we keep on making mistakes every now and then. So today we will discuss about this phrase and how to use this phrase in our daily life and the rules. Now look at these sentences. One of the member, one of the student, one of the lecture, one of the doctor, one of the participant, one of the tourist. Now here you notice that there is a phrase one of the word one of so one of one of means only one one of is singular keep in mind there are certain rules first rule is that one is singular remember that one represent one you can see there are a lot of students so when we are talking about one of it means out of these many we are talking about one one of is a singular term and generally used to talk about a noun or a pronoun so one of is singular remember the noun or a pronoun used after this phrase one of is always in the plural form so we can say one of the members one of the students one of the lectures one of the doctors one of the participants and one of the tourists because we are talking about one person place or thing out of many many members many students many lectures many doctors many participants and many tourists so we are talking about one so rule number two is now or pronoun will be in the plural form now we are using helping verb we are completing these sentences so we can say one of the members was ill one of the members was ill one of represent singular the members means many members and we are talking about one one of the members was is so was is about one of so we have one subject one now we are using helping verb and we are completing sentences so we can write one of the members was ill we are using her singular helping verb was because we are talking about one of so we can write one of the students was selected in the debate competition one of the lectures means out of many lectures you're talking about one one so we can write one of the lectures was interesting one of the doctors out of many doctor we are talking about one so we will use singular helping verb one of the doctor is attending the seminar one of the participants is working on science project one of the tourists out of many tourists we're talking about one of the tourists was lost in the jungle so now you can see that we have used these helping verb was 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 is is was these all are singular helping verb because they represent one of and one of is singular one remember helping verb after noun or pronoun will be always in the singular form because singular verb agrees with one of not with noun or pronoun rule number three is helping verb is always in the singular form now let's practice one of the boys is tall boys is tall or we will use are tall bahut sare boys mein se hum baat kar rahe hain ek boy ki one of the तो हमारा हेल्पिंग वर्ब होगा इज वन ऑफ द बॉयज इज टॉल वन ऑफ देम देम इज प्रोनाउन वन ऑफ देम वॉज सेलेक्टेड टू विजिट नासा देम बहुत सारों में से एक सो हेर वी यूज 
helping verb was for time being if you hide then one was selected or one word selected one of them was selected to visit nasa helping verb will be singular one of the cars bahut sari cars mein se ek one of the cars will go to the parking area so we can use will for help singular and plural both it cars so we'll use one of the cars will go to the parking area here we are using helping verb will will can be used for singular and plural both rules to remember number 1 the one is a singular term number 2 the noun or pronoun used after the phrase one of is always in the plural form number 3 the helping verb will always be in the singular form These are the three components you need to be aware of. I hope now you don't make mistakes. I hope you enjoyed it. It will be so easier if you keep on practicing and using it in your daily life. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day ahead.